See how nice this 3D map. It has five different scenes. Do you want to know how these different scenes were created? Please stay tuned and I will teach you. Our data shows total cases of coronavirus of affected countries or places. To create 3D map, select the whole data, go to insert tab, and click 3D map. Take note that internet connection is needed to create 3D map. Now, this is our 3D map with dots or bars of those affected countries. We can remove the field list. Let's choose total cases as the basis of the height of the bars. Observe how height of bars change. Remove the region. Let's go to layer options. Increase the height of the bars as well as the thickness. Now it looks better. To show names of the countries, click the map levels. Use these signs to navigate the map. You can also use the computer mouse to drag or navigate the map. Change the color of bars under layer options. Choose the second design as our theme. Now let's create our first scene. You can see at the left side that this is our scene 1. Our first scene will be America. To edit the scene, the first method is to click scene option. The second method is to click the gear icon on the scene 1 box. Scene duration will be 10 seconds. Transition duration will be 3 seconds. Let's change effect into flyover. Adjust the effect distance. To see how this scene looks like, click this arrow sign. Now this is our first scene in full screen in 10 seconds. To exit from full screen, click the small arrow or press escape in your computer case. We need to create text box. Write the title, change the background color, click create when done. Move the text box and adjust the size. Now we can have the tour again to have a second look. Then exit from full screen. Click new scene to add a second scene. Our second scene will be Africa and the Middle East. Double click the text box to edit it. Change the title as well as the background color. Click OK when done. Adjust the size of the box. Click the gear icon to change the scene options. Scene and transition duration will be the same. Let's change the effect into circle. Effect speed will be adjusted. Let's have a tour on our second scene. This looks fine. Let's create the third scene. This will be in Europe this time. Change the text box again with title and background color. Make the tour again. We forgot to change the scene option. Press escape. Go to scene options. Change the effect into push in. Now let's have a look. Everything is good for our third scene. Let's add the fourth scene. This time will be Asia and the Pacific. Edit the text box again with title and background color. Go to scene options. Change the scene duration into 15 seconds. Change the effect into Dali. Change the effect distance. Now let's have a tour. Everything looks fine so let's exit from full screen. Let's make a little adjustment. Now let's have our fifth and last scene. This time will be the whole world. As usual, edit text box. This time, we will change also the font color. Adjust the box. Start the map with America. Zoom out the map. Go to Zen options. Change the effect into rotate the globe. Now let's have the tour. 
This is great, right? Press escape. To have a tour of all the five scenes together in sequence, click play tour. Watch and enjoy the presentation. That's it. What a nice presentation. This is a great help in classroom or office meeting. Like, share, and comment. For more detailed tutorial on how to create 3D map in Excel, click this end screens. Thanks for watching.